Hi, today we calibrate USM Go. First of all, we need to switch it on. The bottom here, press a couple seconds. One, two, that's it. Wait. We have a probe. It uh, will be dual because it's a, um, you see, two, two sections. And what we need to do? First of all, uh, we need to slot, take some gel. If we calibrate, for instance, 18, we need to we need to put gel on 15 and 20 because it's in the middle. Okay, what we need to do here? First of all, we need to change uh, range. If we have 15, 20, we need to we need to see three signals. If it's 20 mil, it's uh, supposed to be 20, 20, 20, and uh, 10 more. It's uh, 70. We change to let it be 75 range. Now, if we press here, we cannot see any signals. Now we need now we need to change probe delay usually it's around eight nine we're gonna change it to nine first around nine Okay, next step, next step, we need to change velocity, it's a speed, probe delay, it's just here, how the probe delay, and we need to change the speed, speed, it's for carbon steel, it's uh, 5, 9, 6, 0, approximately. Okay, also we go there, pulse, receiver, and change frequency. We check the probe, on the probe it says 5 MHz. Uh, normally it's 4, but here it's 5. We change it to 5, full wave and dual, because it's a double crystal, two, signal, uh, two signals. Okay, next one, you can leave the same. Now we trying to find our signal. What we need to do? Just need to put again, high again, again. And now we see our signal. And next step is to put a gate, first gate, green gate there and blue there we go here and go to gate A first gate starts a little bit wide, wider like this we change change wide and start now it's now it's exactly where we want we put more gain that it will be approximately 80% of the screen. Next step is uh, find the gate B. Oh, it's coming. And now what we see? Now we have on a block. 15 mil 15 mil now what we do we 
we go on the first page a change uh, first of all first of all we, we press here a long press and do some changing uh, some settings we need to change it's supposed to be like this like that it's important that uh, we have SBA first SBA it's mean that we can measure without paint it will be result a result without paint this is first signal this is second signal and this is calculated automatically without paint and here I say the first signal with paint next go configuration supposed to look like like that configuration 2 it's important to put positive gain gate A and gate B say and here functional is a joystick it means the joystick show that we can change the tables and important to put a recall data because we can find later all, all savings what we need to have okay next configuration it's configuration number three you can see here configuration number four and now we go again on the main main page we did what we need and we press again in the middle there wait yes now we are on the main page okay and now we need to this is the result total result without paint this is uh, this is yeah minus paint this is the first signal just uh, with paint this is 17 shows the first signal 31 it's 0.9 shows second signal and that one minus that one equal 14 86 here is supposed to be 15 because we have 15 and there are 15 i will show the easiest way it doesn't mean calibration easiest way it doesn't mean it's correct but it's the easiest for you what we, we go to prob, uh, velocity first and we we see that this here will be 15 go up speed is going up okay now we speed around 6014 and now we go for probe delayed to check that SA will be 15 also we go other way a little bit more much go back okay almost okay now we have 15 but we need to hold the probe hold the probe because the result will be a little bit different just not too much can change a little bit more okay now it's 15 15 now it's calibrated on a 15 we check 20 20 mil and there it shows shows perfect and now it's complete calibration now you can start work